Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to do a really quick and easy master cleanse haul for you guys. And in addition to the master cleanse haul, I'm going to show you how to make one gallon of master cleanse so that you can have for two days. So I'll give you more details as we get into the video and you'll see why I'm doing it for two days. Um, and what else do I want to tell you guys? Oh, in the haul, I'm going to show you some products that make the master cleanse a lot easier to do. Let's get into it. Okay, so here is my master cleanse haul. You'll see here that I have a lot of lemons. These are fresh organic lemons. And I also have um, some lime juice. That is Santa Cruz lime juice back there. Um, that Santa Cruz lime juice is organic, it's concentrated, it doesn't have anything added to it. And I always tell people that using something like a organic lime or lemon juice for your master cleanse is a great way to make it very easy to do if you do not want to juice lemons or limes. Um, if you're short on time, you want to simplify things for whatever reason you can definitely use an organic lemon or lime juice. Something that doesn't have anything added to it. I really love that Santa Cruz, Santa Cruz brand because they don't add anything artificial to theirs. Um, I also have my Smooth Move tea that you'll be taking every night. And then I have sea salt. Now the sea salt, I do not do the salt water flushes, but I just wanted to show you a good brand of sea salt that you can pick up at your local market if you're going to be doing the saltwater flush. Now back here I have these Mountain Valley spring water. Um, I really like this water because it has natural minerals in there. The one to me that really stands out is the magnesium. I find a lot of people are deficient in mag magnesium and it has a calming effect. It's so good for you for so many reasons so I like to have that on hand to drink in between. Now that Maple syrup back there is dark maple syrup. That's what you want to look for. I really like this particular maple syrup. I get this sometimes because it's really easy to use. It squeezes out. The cap is not removable, so it's not easy to lose the cap. It's just like attached to it, so it just flips, off, flips up and then um, snaps back down. Hey guys, as I'm editing this video, I realized that I left off a very important part. So I'm just hopping in to let you guys know about the maple syrup. The maple syrup, um, if you are following the book and the original recipe, it's going to tell you to get grade B maple syrup. So a few years ago, um, I guess the powers that be decided, decided that they were going to take away grade B altogether. Now, it doesn't mean that you can't find that particular um, type of maple syrup. It just means that they changed all of the maple syrup that's you know organic or um, natural maple syrup to grade A, but they have a light and a dark. So the one that you want to get is the dark. So back before they changed it, um, the dark one was the grade B. So if you're out there looking for grade B maple syrup, um, you won't see it. You will see grade A light or dark. So grab the dark one. That's the one you want. Just wanted to hop in and let you guys know that so you're not out there searching for grade B and wondering why you can't find it. I find that a lot of times with the other caps, even if they stay on, it kind of like gets everywhere. And because this, one's in a, this one is in a squeezy bottle, it's pretty much um, like a cleaner situation, and easier to keep track of the cap and easier to keep it nice and clean, which is important, especially with syrup. <laughs> so this is everything that I got for the um, haul. And I also wanted to point out that lime juice is acceptable for your master cleanse. I know that everyone associates lemons with the master cleanse because it's also been dubbed the lemonade diet. But lime is acceptable in the original book that was written on the master cleanse in the 60s. Um, lime was mentioned as an alternative to lemon. And then also in the other book that came out several years after that talks about losing 10 pounds and feeling great in 10 days using the master cleanse also mentions that limes are acceptable. So that's something to keep in mind if you want to you know, go back and forth. 
and kind of switch things up from day to day and just have a different taste going on. You know, it's still a, it's still a citrus, but you'll have a different flavor. And I don't see why you couldn't um, even do half and half in each batch. So you kind of have like a lemon lime juice going on. You'll also see that I do have the cayenne pepper there. And it's an organic cayenne pepper that's going to boost your metabolism and get things going along. A lot of people don't like the spiciness of the cayenne pepper, so you can definitely play around with the amount. I would say um, start off with the recommended amount, and if it's too spicy for you, just cut it back a little bit to the point where you're still adding it to get the benefit, but um, it's not you know, making it so spicy that you don't want to drink it at all. I will leave the full recipe in the description box below. But I always also wanted to mention that I am going to give you guys the full recipe if you want to make a gallon at a time. Now, a gallon at a time is going to give you about 128 ounces of um, everything that you you know need for the drink. And the reason why sometimes people like to do a gallon at a time is because that's actually like two days of serving. Now, in the book, it is recommended that you do it freshly every day, but I think that, you know, 24 hours is not um, that big of a deal personally because it is going to be refrigerated, of course, and you're going to be consuming it right away that next day. Now, making a gallon at a time also comes handy if you are doing it with someone else um, in your household. So it could be a roommate, it could be your partner. Um, you know, you two guys together are going to do the master cleanse. So having a recipe for the gallon, it, it can really come in handy. So I'll leave that information in the description box below. And I'm so glad that you guys are benefiting from this video. And definitely check out the other videos that I have on the master cleanse. I'll link them in the description box as well. Hope you guys are having a great evening and I'll see you in the next video.